Yes, I actually believe that today, and I of course didn't know this when I was in this other relationship where I wasn't really awake nor was I conscious. Yeah. That relationships are there as a gift. Every relationship that we have with anybody, they are trying to give us a gift. It's up to us if we want to receive it or not. And if we don't, we're going to get the same gift from somebody else <laughs> somebody down else. the road. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. Same thing, different face, right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So, I'm actually very curious what kind of relationship would I create today because I changed so much. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, I'm, I'm not even absolutely sure what it would be like because I wouldn't be in a relationship with anybody because I wanted something from them, you know? Right. It would be different, for sure. That's why I just... <laughs> that's, not, that's not important to me. <laughs> the people and, you know, do what I'd like to do. Um, so, it, at the beginning when you talked about all the things that, you know, maybe I was a wife, a mother, and it, it's strange how, you know, I have two sons, they're grown, um, mm -hmm. how even probably a year ago, I went through a thing uh, thinking, well, who am I? You know, I'm no longer a wife. I'm I'm a mother, but my kids don't need me. They're grown. You know, it's trying to figure out who you are. So, mm -hmm. you know, your question made me think, and it's like, you know, here on earth I try to be loving and, and peaceful and, you know, hope it helps in some capacity. Oh, yes, it does. Because you're displaying something very important that everybody wants and so what you're doing is you're being an example for other people you you are walking to talk versus <laughs> see you the kind of person is just what I'm getting is that unlike my cat you don't talk much you don't have to just your being and what you the energy that you're putting out into the world is enough. Aww. Does that make sense? Yeah, I thank you. I there are some nights where I can't sleep at all and um that's been going through rapid I think spiritual growth over the last well probably since I got divorced, but <laughs> <laughs> I was free to be me. You see, one door closes, yeah, another one opens. But and you opened the big door. Yeah, there's still some sadness, but I think, you know, it's uh, lots of memories, good and not so good. So, um, we're always where we need to be, is what I think. Mm -hmm. But times when I don't sleep, it's just like sending, you know, picturing this loving energy coming from my heart area and just sending it out to the world and and praying that people experience peace. Yeah, and I noticed that you're also a uh, Reiki practitioner. Mm -hmm. So you must be really tuned into... See, I believe that everything is energy. Like what we're doing on, on this show right now, <laughs> it's, uh, it's yeah. all energy. You know, the fact that we see what we see and we feel what we feel, <clears throat> it's, all an, it's all an illusion. <laughs> yeah. It is. You know, it's really just energy, pure energy, and and you have this ability. You must. I mean, in order to do what you do, you you feel. You must feel and see energy more so than most people. I do. Is that mm -hmm. Feeling it. I. For me, it's difficult. Oh, probably the last three years to be out in a crowd because it's like being bombarded by someone sad, someone is physically ill, um, someone's really stressed. I mean, it's like I feel all that. 
Um, mm -hmm. How do you protect yourself? How do I what? How do you protect yourself from um, from different energies that you don't really want to be exposed to? I say lots of prayers. I, is it okay to to mention angels or <laughs> I don't know? Sure. Uh, Archangel it's okay Michael. Okay to mention anything you want. Okay. <laughs> um, Archangel Michael, I ask for protection. Uh, different stones. We don't have censorship on this show. Okay. Well, I, didn't know. <laughs> I don't know that much about you, but I've learned quite a bit. I'm the I'm the only censor. <laughs> okay. All right. Um, lots of prayers, you know, and sometimes taken when too much of other people's stuff can, you know, it attaches to people. It's like taking a tub soak with sea salt and essential oils, and sometimes I'll use um, incense and smudge and um, spend a lot of time outdoors. Uh, rejuvenating, sitting on the grass, 